Hi guys, this is Tanya Meadows with Apple Tree Homeschool Academy, and today I have a haul, shopping haul for our home daycare. Let's get started. First up, I have items for the 4th of July Independence theme, and these are just the things that I've bought today, and I have other uh, items that I previously got. I've got watermelon and uh, strawberries to bring in the red and the uh, theme and I added some tomatoes and some blueberries of course and then also for food we've got some mini marshmallows we may end up making rice crispy treats with those I'm not sure I've got plenty of sugar here so um, some white cheddar crackers and we'll serve that with some uh, white cheese sticks I've never bought uh, these kind of donuts for the daycare kids, but uh, I went ahead and splurged uh, for this week. So I've got some white powdered donuts, and I'm going with a red, red, white, and blue theme of food. So I picked up these strawberry shortcake rolls and these red, white, and blue Twinkies. And on one breakfast, we'll add uh, one or two of these little strawberry bar cookies. Uh, along with some fruit and uh, probably some eggs, some scrambled eggs. So our day one, I didn't have any red, white, and blue Play-Doh, so we did use yellow. And on my Play-Doh tray, I have the letters USA, some star, star shapes, the um, outline of the United States, an American flag. I've got a, a garlic press and a little mini rolling pin. And uh, the USA and the uh, outline of the United States and the flag all came from uh, Michael's Craft Store a year or two ago. I think it was last year after the uh, end of the season, and I got those on sale. And the um, tools I got at Walmart years ago. And uh, we'll be talking about the shape, star shape all week. So I went ahead and picked up some Play-Doh. Now I got this for $3.00 a pack at the dollar store and, or the Dollar Tree and I went ahead and got two packs and for the the red, the white and I like this dark color blue so I uh, needed that for our Play-Doh and a few weeks ago I had picked up three packs of these little coloring kits this is a wooden figure and uh, I had three of them already so I went ahead and picked up two more so I needed those. I did see this little pail at Walmart for $0.97 cents, and this little red and white pail for, um, I think it was either a dollar or a dollar twenty-five at the Dollar Tree. And then to add to our uh, art supplies, I picked up this set of um, stars. I think this may have come at the... Um, Walmart or the or the dollar store, I'm not sure. And then I picked up this little set of cutouts at the dollar store. I thought maybe we'd put some googly eyes on here and make a face. And then there's 32 pieces here. So I'll be able to laminate these and back them with magnetic tape and use them as a counting activity on the whiteboard, on the magnetic whiteboard. I have a circus, safari, and wild animal theme um, bin, and I picked up these products to go into the bin. Uh, we do that over the summer as well, and that will be coming up next. So I picked up two of these little wooden uh, sets of um, animals that are elephants, lions, and gorillas, and there's two of each kind in a pack so there's six per pack and I went ahead and got two packs um, so that each child can choose have a cho choice of which one they want and I have plenty for them to choose uh, I love this book that I found at the dollar store the figures were wooden figures were at the dollar store as well this is God's Little Zoo Polite and Brave and I will be also having a um, mermaid pirates and tropical island theme which i'll show you in a minute and the little there's two little stories in this book it's teaching about character traits and so the little toucan there 
will uh, go for our island theme and then the little tiger there will go with our her story will go with our wild animal theme but this is uh, I stood there and went ahead and read through it and made sure that it was appropriate and it's a wonderful little book I love it so there's a story here and then there's a second story on be brave so this is really this will go with both of my summer themes here and then at Walmart, I found these two sets of paper masks, and it'll come with uh, three tigers and three lions and uh, two bears. So eight pieces come in this set, and I went ahead and bought two sets again so that each child has their choice. And then I'm going to save the bears back because we do a bear theme, a teddy bear's picnic during the summer and we'll serve berries and have uh, blueberries for sow book and the teddy um, teddy grams and uh, all kinds of fun things to do we'll sit on and have our snack on a picnic tape uh, blanket indoor outdoor depending on the weather so um, we'll save back the the bear mask for that theme and um, our next thing coming up will be the wild animals, and so that'll be great for that. And this is just added to a collection that we've already have. So add to your collection little by little. I do a, a pirate, mermaid, and tropical island theme, and we also include ocean animals as well. And we'll use this over pretty much an entire month. And so I picked up these lays, these little beautiful lays at the Dollar Tree. I'll show you what some of these look like. For that, I went ahead and picked up two packs of these plastic ones. And then this, I got two of these. One of this pretty blue here. I have all girls enrolled at this time, so I went ahead and went with more of the feminine and picked up the plastic just in case. Um, we have any of the boys that um, need to sh come on a particular day. Sometimes um, I'm a backup babysitter for some boys. So um, this was really pretty, I thought. So I picked up the lace for a dramatic play. I found these little mermaid bu bubbles. And all of this came from the Dollar Store or the Dollar Tree. I'm going to put together a little... Um, treasure chest so I found these little rings these little gemmed rings I thought these little crystals look like uh, diamonds and these coins were a nice size so to prevent from a choking hazard so I thought those were nice I picked up three of those and uh, we'll be doing a black and red theme to go with the pirates so I picked up two dabbers this way and I found this book here, I Can Draw That, and it's ocean animal themed. And this I probably will actually put into our homeschooling supplies. My group is too small and too young to be able to use this book. But my daughter, um, who helps me, is my assistant. She'll, she may be able to draw some of these pictures and show the kids how to do that and show how it's done picked up two books of stickers the dollar store seems to be or the dollar tree seems to be the best place to get your stickers i haven't had very good luck finding stickers at walmart and this was a really good um, set here so picked up two of these and all of this go is going with our tropical island theme and i picked up some play-doh to go with that theme and it matches the lace. And then along the same time, we will have a lemonade stand using the Melissa and Doug uh, grocery store that I have. And we will take um, rice skirts that I previously got at the dollar store on a previous year, wrap it around the bottom of the grocery store, and we'll put signs on the top of it and switch it over to the lemonade stand. And so I found these um, little plates and picked up some uh, plain yellow plates for when we do our lemonade stand. And I'd like to turn it into actually 
uh, a juice bar as well and found I found all of these um, decorations so these are plates that's in a watermelon shape half of a watermelon or half of a lemon and then this is a decoration for a dollar this is a decoration for a dollar this sweet summer fruit stand juice bar and what else I think that's everything for that and so uh, I would love to be able to get a Melissa and Doug little smoothie maker but uh, that's on my wish list for now I'm not quite sure that my video taped um, previously talking about um, these three items but I got this little book that has two stories in it and these uh, animals wooden animals at the dollar store and then I found these masks at um, Walmart and if I didn't say before if it didn't capture it it comes with some little teddy bears and we'll save that for my teddy bear picnic theme I picked up these three sets of plates at the Dollar Tree as well and this is going to go into our ice cream shop theme Okay, these items are a little bit random and we'll be going into uh, various themes that I'm putting together that I don't have very many items for. But I have toys and all kinds of good stuff, themed um, activities and binders all put together for a lot of our themes. But these are themes that I'm just starting to put to to get together. But this fun with baking sticker activity book, all of these things I got from pretty much the Dollar Tree as well but this is a really nice book um, it's fun with baking it comes with stickers and I love this I'll be able to use this in the winter time around Christmas season with the gingerbread and then it's got all kinds of real pictures of baked goods and uh, this is going to be great for our sweet shop theme that I have around the Christmas time and so we'll be able to get a lot of good use on that so I picked up I think five books of this five copies of this and then I had previously found this book for um, at the Dollar Tree as well and I found a second copy I only they only had one copy when I was there and it's more cost-effective for me See if I can get that to come in focus for you. There you go. Um, it's more cost effective for me to go ahead and get these books for a dollar than to find these and print them out. And it also saves me a ton of time. Previously, I had only gotten one of these uh, dinosaur themed sticker books packs. And I picked up two more because I don't think they had uh, any more the last time I was there. And the same thing, I'm getting a brand new theme together. I'm going to think I'm going to put house and home and pets all in one, one theme. And so here's some pets. Got a little bit started with, with a pet theme. Not much, but there are stickers. And then um, over here I found this God Made Seasons little board book for a dollar. 25 I think because a lot of the prices are going up so and then walk through the seasons it's similar to uh, these other two books here and this will go with my um, North American forest animals but I really like that they're using real pictures in this with the stickers so that seasons and walk through the seasons will go together and then similar to this set here, I got this God Made Colors. So this is a color board book. So anytime you can get a board book for a dollar, grab them up. I need desperately to do some pens, and I'm always collecting my googly eyes, storing them into my art supplies. I got this at the dollar store, it was cheaper. Priced them at Walmart, it was definitely cheaper getting them at the dollar store. And then I saw somebody have an idea of taking the dauber printables that you can get. And instead of using the daubers, having them use their small muscles to um, 
have the children peel the stickers off, the little circle stickers, and putting them on those little dauber um, printables that you can get. And so uh, we're going to probably use the blue and the red in those for um, for our um, Independence Day thing. So I hope you like this um, haul, and I hope you have some ideas, got some good ideas. Let us know what you do for your themes down in the comments. Like this video, share it, and um, subscribe if you feel like you get some inspiration from our videos. So I hope you like everything and hope it gives you some good ideas. Thanks for watching. Bye.